Hi everyone, welcome to another video. Do you recognise where we are? This is going to be our first official video in the old post office and my goodness I miss it so much. It's so lovely being in here and seeing all of your beautiful pieces of artwork and drawings and oh. But today we are here for a special reason and that's because it's the beginning of Advent. So we are going to decorate the window Christmas themed. So I've been out shopping to get supplies for the plan. So what we are going to do is we have got lots of black paper and we are going to cover the whole main window in the middle black and we're going to cut out lots of little flame shapes in the black paper, 24 of them, so that's one for every day of Advent. We're also going to have a manger at the bottom and to add a little bit of sparkle and pizzazz I have bought some Christmas lights so they are going to flicker through where the candles have been cut out and just look really really pretty. And we might put the word hope above the manger as well because that's important isn't it, especially this year, this time of year. We all need a bit of hope, don't we? So, that is the plan. So, before we begin, let's do a little before shot. There we go, that's it before. So hopefully in a few hours that will all be ready and glammed up, ready for tonight when it's all dark and the lights will look so pretty and bright. So, let's make a start. So I've got a big workstation here. I'm going to spread the whole thing out with black paper to fit the measurements of the window, sellotape all together, and then we'll go from there. We officially have the biggest piece of paper in the world. It's not looking that pretty, but that's okay because this is gonna be the back. So now it's time to start plotting out our candles and cutting them out. So the flames are all not cut out. They do look a little bit like raindrops, but it's okay because next we have got this really pretty kind of material with little gold flecks in, which we are gonna put over the candles. So they're just gonna look very nice and glowy. And also we're gonna add a little base to each of the candles. And we're gonna do that in this lovely red velvet because how pretty and Christmassy is that? So this is gonna go here on the back side, and then this will go on the front side after that. I would just like to say my cutting is not that bad but the way the camera was leaning on the box meant that I couldn't reach so that's why the cutting looks like that. <laughs> it's time to finally flip it and we can hopefully get a prettier picture from the front side. Look at that! Looking so much cleaner and prettier so now we need to get a manger here, we need to get the little red stands underneath the candles but it's really coming together now, I'm excited. Look at that, it looks so good. Now it's time for the manger. Ready to see it? Ready. Look at that! Oh my goodness! Doesn't this look so much better than the back? <laughs> All we gotta do is let this dry and then we can put it on the window with the lights. Guys, it's ready. I haven't looked at it yet, all I've seen is from the back, and the back just looks crazy. Wow, what a beautiful display. <laughs> but let's go check it out, here are the lights. Oh, ready? Ah! Okay, let's go outside. 